Rick Ross gives advice on protecting yourself when considering investing in real estate. Morning glory, morning glory, the boss voice back. My voice back, I had a good time in Vegas, but look, well, y'all niggas better be about y'all money, y'all niggas better be about y'all business. Tell all them foo-foo niggas with foo-foo plays that miss y'all with that. Don't get tied up in that, miss you with that. You about your business, you about your money. I'm finna get on another Zoom call or two. I'm finna talk business. One time for all the brand ambassadors. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. One time for all the partners. One time for that Double MG squad. You already know what it is, and everybody ready for that Double MG music. Get ready. It's finna go down in a major way. We finna smoke some high tolerance. We finna talk some business. If you're a boss, you better be about your money, because if you're not about your money, it'll be somebody else that's about your money. And they're gonna be about your money in a major way. Hey. Hey, do you believe these motherfuckers really want to see you win? Do you believe it? Man, it's something you can't be afraid to do. You can't be afraid to handle your own business. You ain't got to gang up with niggas to do all your businesses. You ain't got to gang up on every business venture. Don't be scared to go solo. Don't be scared to start solo dolo, nigga. Don't be scared to jump off the porch by yourself. You ain't got to jump that money every time. Listen, and for real, a lot of this shit is common sense. We all want to be in real estate. Everybody want to be a boss. I got it, but be patient. Because we can't get in business with 15 names on one deed, 15 names on one piece of land. That'll be 15 niggas you fight. 15 names on one piece of land. 14 niggas going to take the stand. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm just talking to the hustlers For real And for the real hustlers Want to know how I This how you do it You got your couple dollars You want to be a real estate guru Mogul Go get your auntie Yeah the one that got the good job The one you could trust Go get your auntie Put that shit in her name You can't trust them motherfuckers That you talking to in your DMs You know the DMs is the TMs That's the DMs it's always a way for a nigga to climb out a hole. Cause it's always gonna be a hole for a nigga to hit. A pothole or a real deep hole, either way. But you know what we gonna make the word for the day is, stop trusting them strangers. Don't trust them DMs. Stop trusting strangers. Y'all know when y'all got that PPP money, y'all went and shop with nothing but strangers. Y'all went and invested with nothing but strangers. Y'all niggas went to college with nothing but strangers. <laughs> Why is this so stupid? <laughs> so this life, okay, you did some business, some people did some bad business with you, they got you. Somebody ran off with some money, you took a loss, boom, boom, I get it. Lesson learned, you know not to take that route again. But here's the money, how the do you come up out that hole? Huh? How you gonna do it? It's different ways now. You could get a nigga to throw you a rope, do a little networking. That's what real niggas do. Or you could go take what's yours. Or you could go back to the mud, start digging. You want me to keep going? I got motherfuckers offering me every day to buy this shit. Motherfuckers say, Rose, you should be selling this shit. Man. I ain't even thinking about that. This for the hustlers that's tapping in early with Rose. I know it's somebody somewhere documenting all this shit. It's too much game, giving niggas too much game. And I don't even wanna charge you. Morning glory, nigga, you woke up this morning. I woke up, we won. Hey yo, this shit ain't funny and I ain't laughing, but it's funny, right? Bitch, had to hit me up, whatever, told me she was a real estate investor. Long story short, the whole put $700, you know what I'm saying? She had 300 square feet or whatever, this little piece of property. The property was total 8,000. So it was a bunch of bitches put $700 to get to the 8,000. Ho asked me what, you know, what I thought the way she should handle because, you know, the shit went to shambles. Bitch, just walk away from that shit. <laughs>
Thanks for tuning in to NIMAG TV.